Gladstone Street to Harrington Central House, the adult children's services, youth friendly and all sorts. North Road Police Station apparently. Oh yeah, look. And civic enforcement. Civic enforcement for those who don't know. <laughs> um, traffic wardens, dog warden. Basically, any anyone employed by a council. And this would be where they're based. Let's see. Social services end. This is the drug and alcohol action team. Oh, and the police station here. And there's one of the wardens there. A wide variety of services. It says, oh, so that's yeah, that's the police station entrance. Drug and alcohol action team, youth offending super communities. I'm just filming. Oh, what for? I'm just filming. Any, anything I can see. All right. Okay. <laughs> okay then. All right. Do you work for, the, is it civic enforcement? Is that like traffic wardens and dog wardens? It's, we're not wardens. Right. But, uh, same job role. <laughs> well, no, we I'm do sure. a multitude of things. Right, we do okay. fly tips, environmental crime, right. abandoned vehicles. All right. Parking, yes, is one of them. Right. Okay. okay. Excellent. Thank you. Enforcement officers. obviously the council side of things. You'd think it was police, wouldn't you, at the uh, at night? That's obviously the entrance for social services, although there is other doors around there. The back. And the this was an old school, which was central, I believe. Is quite different. Can I help you? No, not at all, thanks. I'm just wondering what you're doing. Um, I just explained to one of the civic enforcement officers I'm filming. What are you filming? A anything I can see from public. Right, and is there a reason behind that? Um, it's for a story. Right, okay, can I take your details, please? Um, what, what would you like my details for? 
because obviously in the interests of public safety and everything like that when somebody is out filming and having a look around public buildings right we have a duty of care right to check you out what a duty of care to whom to the general public i'm part of the general public yes i don't have to give you my details though right i can just get other people well <laughs> other people still i'm still not obliged to give you my details I'm asking because I, I, at I'm the refusing. moment, I don't know whether you are committing any criminal offences in I'm, this I'm, area. I'm certainly not. This gentleman is out filming and is pointing up, looking at all the cameras, um, and obviously in light um, identify of... Identify the cameras up there? In, in light of... I'm not filming that. I'm no. filming up there. I was filming up there when this lady approached. What's, what's the issue? Like? I'm, there isn't an issue. Oh, I'm right. just wondering why he's filming. Yeah, well, I'm, perfect, I'm perfectly entitled to to, to film anything no. I can any right, feared... hang on wait a minute I'm perfectly entitled to film anything I can see from a public place including council buildings that are owned by the public okay we have concerns about and, public safety and your concerns are we don't know who you are and that's what not a concern links it is it isn't in this in the day and age that we are in I, I, are, you, are you accusing me of being a terrorist i'm not accusing anybody of anything but do you have reasonable suspicion to, to believe that i'm up to anything other than i don't know what you are right. up to go on to google google film in the public it'll tell and even legislation tell me what i need to do right well right? right well don't tell me that i need to give my details when i know that i don't i'd like you to move away from this area please otherwise you need I a section have... 60. You need a set to, to, to remove somebody from an area without probable cause, you need a section 60. Well, I'm concerned for public safety and what you are doing well, in this I've area. Well, I've told you what I'm doing in this area. Well, you need to move away from here now. Right, please. well, I'll move to the other side of the road, if that's all right. You've obviously got nothing else better to do with your no. time, have you? Well, well, that's not your concern. What, what I do with my time is nobody's concern but mine. Fair enough. Okay. Can I ask you to identify yourself? You haven't got any uh, numbers on your pellets? 1,000. 1,000. And name? Sarah Bainbridge. And yours? 2629. You're also on body cam. Yeah, that, that's fine. Um, and you're based here? Yes. Yeah, excellent. Well, I'm based out of Darlington. Right, OK. Excellent. Hello there. Hi, oh, yeah, you're Hello. Right. This gentleman is filming. He's now refusing to give any details. and I'm, I'm not obliged to. Uh, I can't understand why he's out filming um, buildings, council buildings, refusing to give any details in light of the incidents that we're having around the area. At the and, and those in incidents, whatever they may be, no concern of mine, nothing but to do with me. I don't know who you are well, and I can't check you out. Well, you don't need to. Yes, I do, because I have a duty of care to I'll the I'll tell you what it is, mate, it's anti-terrorism. Uh, there's, no terrorist, there's no terrorist threat. At yeah, the moment, yeah, but, yeah, but, I don't yeah, know who you what are. Do, what do you mean there's no terrorist threat? There's, at there's, the moment, we're still on high. There's no terrorist threat at the moment, and nor has there been over the past five years, towards any public buildings, any public buildings. That's a lie, because there was one yesterday, actually. Was yeah. there? Well, I yes. wasn't aware of that. Well, where was there that? there you go. So, so where was that? So we don't know. So yeah. Here? Yes, it was, actually. Right. Yeah, yeah, there was one to the council offices as well. Right. In Darlington? By an unknown yeah. male. Right. There was a bomb hoax yesterday. Was there? At 11 o'clock yesterday, uh, so yesterday morning. Right. By an unknown male. That's, not, that's nothing to do with me, that's no concern of mine. How, how do we know well, that? Well, they were, were, they, were, they, were, they, were they still outside with a mobile phone? Look, I'm not, we're not getting into this. Well, I am now asking you to leave the area because I feel that you... On, on what grounds? Because you are no, alarming no, the, the public. No, no, which, which section of the law? You give me the section of the law, I'll quite happily move. You just need... Uh, uh, beg your pardon? I'm just a... I never said one word. <laughs> you liar. I'm, I'm not going to talk to you anymore. I'm not going to talk to anybody. Right, we're filming you as well. That's, that's, that's fine. It's public. Just stand here perfectly until okay. you move out of the it's way. Okay. It's perfectly okay to film in public, which is what I was explaining to your colleague. Right. I'll just stand here. You can, you can stand there as long as you want. So apparently there was a bomb hoax yesterday um, in Darlington. I didn't see anything in the media. Um, however, it might just have been overlooked. The architecture on those buildings is quite similar to those ones. What's 1903? It doesn't say on the front of this building where that when this was built.
But the architecture it looks like is quite similar. I know it used to be a school and You gave me your details and I could my de right, so be happy that there is my details. Untoward. My details won't give you any other information. I would like to check you out oh. so that I am happy that I can leave you unattended on you, the side you of can. the road. You've got no you've got no you've got no actual reason other than curiosity as to why I'm filming to be to be stood here. I want asking. to know who you are. Well, to I make sure I don't have to identify myself and you you're well aware of that I know the law just right, as much very as very shortly I will for a, to prevent a breach of the peace you can't uh, a Brent, prevent a breach of the peace if mum was going to take place I I'm not have, breaching anybody's peace I have colleagues and members of the council staff who are very concerned about why you are out here filming in light of the incidents I'm yesterday. I'm filming a story. I'm not filming in light of those incidents. Well, those incidents until weren't I even can, known to me until, until you I made them aware. Prove or negate either way, all I want is your details but, to make sure that no members of the public are of threat to you. They're not. Well, My details wouldn't give you any more information about that. People tell me every day well, how good they are. I'm, sure, I'm, sure, I'm not saying I'm, no I'm not threat. saying, hang on, I'm not saying I'm good. What I'm saying, I'm not denying well, either way. Everybody says every time, all the time, with interactions with the police, it wasn't me. That's because you're no threat. That's because your interaction, instead of instead of accepting what I'm doing is perfectly legal, is to cite laws that don't exist. Say that I that, that cited a law that doesn't you, exist. You told me that you were going to move me. You can't move me without that section, without the powers under a section. I have reasonable grounds to believe you. If you're asking me to move, yes, right, and you can state me a section of the law, I'll move, quite happily. Quite, that, that's a but perfectly reasonable it's request. Fine, it's fine, because we've got do supervision you, do coming in. Do you understand in. what the, the current level of if, threat at the moment Right, if there has been... If there has been a threat, a, a, a threat yesterday yeah. of some sort, then yes, I can understand. Right. So but, I, understand. But, but I wasn't aware of that until yeah. you told me. Right. And so now that's why we need your details. Well, you don't need my details. Yes, we do. So do you have the details who were, uh, whoever it was who, who spoke, you spoke to yesterday? Do you know what's going to happen, right? I'll tell you exactly what's going to happen. You're going to end up getting arrested. For what? Right? Listen, that, no, for, for we're what? speaking to our supervision at the moment, okay? Based on the current threat levels and the incident that happened and now yesterday, we'll get, we'll get an that order out. Get, ended up getting seized, okay, under the terrorism laws. Okay. Your body cameras will also yeah. be made public knowledge to me, and I'll use them. That's fine. I just, I, I, know, I just can't know see who why you you're are. being well, so I, obstructive. We've I'm not being along. obstructive at all. Yeah, I'm not are. obliged. Uh, no, there's no, there's no obstruction because I'm not obliged by law to give you well, unless you, you reason, court, unless yeah. you reasonably assume that I, I don't need to because yeah. it wouldn't go to court. Well, you'd you'd be looking at a lawsuit. You're being obstructive. I don't care. I'm not being obstructive at all. Care. Refusing to give my details when being asked is not an Listen, obstruction. you've asked for our details, okay? Because I'm, as, as a member of the public, yeah. and, and you've been civil servant, you're per, you are legally obliged to give me those details upon request. You've obviously got nothing, nothing else better to do. Well, but that's that's my concern, not yours. Yeah, <laughs> reviewing um, Google, do you know what I mean, and getting yourself up to up to speed on local current laws and stuff. No, that's fine. Right, but you're going to be the one that's going to end up in this different situation. Intimidation and threats from local police. Until I feel that you do not pose a risk to the general public, I will remain with you here. If I was stood on the other side of the road without a camera, you wouldn't have approached me. It's purely because I'm filming. Filming is a perfectly legal activity. Because we don't know why you are filming. But I've told you why I'm filming, for a story. A story for what? For YouTube, for my blog. Right, so who are you? If I you... don't have to identify myself. And you, you, you're well aware of the law regarding identification, stop and search powers and procedures. It's fine. At the moment, my colleagues are on to senior officers so that we can have a power of stop and search to get your details. Good luck with that. I would assume that obviously a lot of these 
windows and, and structures would classify as a listed building. However, those ones at the top have obviously been repaired at some point. So you're detaining me. I'm not detaining you. Oh, so listen. you just said to me I'm not going yeah, anywhere well, listen, at the minute. Listen, where do you intend to go next? Because I'm just going to follow you, right? That's no concern of yours. Right, well listen, I'm just going to follow you because we need, need to speak to you about what you're doing. You can follow me wherever yeah, you like, fine, but right. don't tell me that I'm not going anywhere right. because that's a threat of, of detainment un un unlawfully. Right, listen, okay. do you want, would you like to come back around at the police station while we to. speak to you? No, I don't need to. You don't need no. to? Right, where are you going now? I'm not telling no, you. I'm going to follow you then, okay? You, you follow me. Okay. This is harassment. Mm -hmm. Show another shoulder there from the other officer. I didn't see it on tape, but it was there. carry on filming just in case I would assume that if they don't follow me it's probably because they're watching CCTV images <laughs> 